What's up my darlings, welcome back to Mass Effect 2. So last time we went on Legion's loyalty mission, which I can't believe I'm still saying, to be honest. I'm still recovering from last time, not only having a Geth crewmate, but also doing his loyalty mission. It also contained one of the most difficult decisions I've had to make in the game so far. It was really intense. Today, I cannot believe I'm saying this, we have made it to the end game of Mass Effect 2. The Omega-4 Relay has arrived. We're doing the suicide mission. I am so nervous. I heard your teammates could die during this mission. I have no idea what to expect. I'm hoping I've done everything I can to prepare us properly, but I'm gonna have no idea until we go in there. Somebody hold my hand, I'm really scared, please. <laughs> I cannot believe Mass Effect 3 is just around the corner. This has been such a long journey. Thank you for being on it with me. So without further ado, grab yourself a drink or a snack, get cozy and let's get to it. Deep breaths, everyone. Deep breaths. This mission in particular has so much hype around it and it's such high stakes. Like I'm very invested in these characters. I don't know what decisions that I've made are going to influence who dies and who doesn't. <laughs> and I'm sure there'll be decisions during the mission also. So I'm like, I'm trying to just like have faith in myself and just do it. All right, my darlings, without further ado, it is time to go and check in with our crew before jumping into the Omega-4 Relay and smashing the collectors. Are we ready? Let's do it. Boop. Ooh, I forgot that we ended the last mission standing next to Legion and not by the galaxy map. Hello, Legion. Did he just turn his back on me? Excuse you. <laughs> Hello, Legion. How are you? I'm really glad you're here, Legion. You're really cool. Thanks for telling me stuff about the Geth that I didn't know before. I was really wrong about you guys. I had the impression that all of you just wanted to kill humanity, but it looks like that's just a small percentage of you. I'm sorry I judged you. Also, I'm sorry for killing a bunch of you in the past. I was just going off of the information that I had. So, I'm sorry if I act kind of weird. I'm just not used to standing this close to a Geth and them not trying to murder me. I'm sorry to stereotype, but you know, but I'm glad you're here to teach me and educate me. All right, see you, dude. <laughs> He's looking at me like... The end game has arrived. I'm ready to go. Shall we talk to everybody and check in with the crew before we jump right in? Shall we start with Legion? It's that album cover. Our new EP is dropping this summer. Look out for it on the Citadel. Hey. Shepard. Hello. Oh, I love his voice. I want to learn about I you. I find out more about you. We are building a consensus. Please try again later. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I love the way his dialogue's written too. Tell me more about Geth. Questions about the Geth. Specify. Let's see if Legion has any upgrades. We need every advantage if this mission is going to succeed. Is there any technology the Geth can share with us? Me? Limited code development is approved. We need to access your FTL comm system to download relevant data. Cool. Yes, please. Edie. Let Legion through the firewalls for a minute. Very well, Shepard. Oh, let's do this Geth shield strength for sure. Boop. Thank you. Um, I think there's a couple other things, but we're gonna go to the research terminal and check that stuff. Well, my dude, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're gonna be riding into the end with us. I'll see you out there. Oop. Hi, Dr. Chocolates. You're amazing, sweetie. Thank you for being here. Garrus! Garrus, I need a hug. Hey, dude. Shepard, need me for something? I just want to talk, man. Got a minute? Sure, just killing time anyway. Not too Hi. much weapons charges, planning attack vectors, you know, relax. <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out how to prepare for this mission. Humans don't deal with stress the way Turians do. Oh, I remember this conversation. This is the part where we're able to potentially get steamy with Garrus. We did this conversation already. So um, I haven't asked him what about Ilos, I don't think. I thought you'd be used to high-risk operations on human ships. 
I mean, think about trekking Saren to Ilos. Sure, but that was quick. We raced out, landed, blew up some geth, and saved the galaxy. I love you, Garrus. Miranda and Cerberus and that AI all telling us what we're up against. I think I preferred blind optimism. <laughs> hey, sometimes knowing less can be better, right? All right, let's see. Um, estimation of chances. What do you think our chances are? Honestly, the Collectors killed you once, and all they did is piss you off. I can't imagine they'll stop you this time. But an unmapped area, advanced technology, and the Collectors. We're going to lose people. No way around that. Oh, Not no. Not analysis, I know. Don't worry. I won't spread it around. And I'm with you regardless. Bless you, Garrus. You're the best. All right, dude. See you later. Thanks for the talk, Garrus. I'll see you later. Sure thing. See you, dude. I love you. Hug. Kinda. Side hug. Alright, see you, man. I'm like taking in everything because things are gonna change after today. Miranda! Hello, boop. Commander, what can I do for you? Can we talk? Do you have a minute, Miranda? Of course. I've been meaning to speak with you, in fact. Okay. I wanted to apologize. I didn't fully believe you'd be up to the task, and it seems I was wrong. Oh. Frankly, based on what I've seen, I wish Cerberus had recruited you earlier. Wow. I wasn't expecting this. It's hard because I feel like she's saying something nice, so I don't want to start shitting on Cerberus. <laughs> you know what I mean? When she's like trying to be nice. I could say so do I, because I could have gotten more done, but also... Uh, I'll just go with Cerberus is wrong. I trust you, but I don't trust Cerberus. Your experiments cross the line. All the time, yes. But I recall a Spectre who crossed a few lines while hunting down Saren and the Geth. And we'd be lucky to have you. Too many join us out of simple xenophobia. We need more people here for the right reasons. I don't think you can really compare me taking liberties to the horrific things that Cerberus has done, but like, I see what you're saying, I guess. <laughs> I saw your monsters, what? What does that mean? Let's try what about Jack, I'm curious. What was Cerberus trying to prove by experimenting on children like Jack? A mistake, Thank no you. question, not mine. And one that was corrected once we discovered the extent of the experiments being performed. She always seems to have an excuse for Cerberus. Uh, it's like saying, oh yeah, Cerberus has done all these horrible things, but you did a couple naughty things. It's like, yeah, I didn't experiment on children, though. <laughs> and I didn't do all these horrific things. Like, come on, dude. I saw your monsters. I saw your bases years ago. You were using Rachni, Thorian creepers, even husks to make your own army. I remember the that. Dead. The Thorian creatures were mindless and the Rachni were abandoned once we understood their intelligence. We weren't breeding an army, we were breeding expendable shock troops for high-risk scenarios. How many soldiers died in Saren's attack on Eden Prime? How many would have lived if we'd had just a dozen Rachni soldiers on our side? I honestly didn't expect anything really different from Miranda because she's going to defend Cerberus. I understand what she's saying and I want I would like to believe that Miranda's view of Cerberus is the truth, but I'm like, they're so underhanded and they do so many terrible things that I'm like, it just sounds like she's making excuses for them or trying to make it not sound as bad as it is. I see where Miranda's coming from, but it's like, it's like this is rehearsed. Like everything I'm saying, she has a prepared answer. It's like, oh, it wasn't that bad. Oh, it wasn't that bad. But it's like, but it was though. And like, when you're trying to compare Cerberus' actions to things that Shepard has done, they don't even come close. Like, it's not even the same league. Cerberus has more money to do terrible things, and Shepard would never experiment on children or use the Rachni like that. It's just, it sounds like somebody who is just trying to defend Cerberus. And uh, it's, it's kind of sad. I mean, of course she is going to defend them. She was basically raised by them, right? So what is she going to do? Speak ill of them? Also, they're probably listening to everything we're saying. Yeah, I mean, you can tell that Miranda has picked up the elusive man's ability to 
downplay everything and make it not sound as bad as it is, I feel like even Miranda isn't fully clued in to the extent of all the things that Cerberus has done. And it's so easy to dismiss these things and be like, oh, it wasn't that bad. Oh, it was just this. We got rid of that when we discovered this. It's like, it's so easy to dismiss those things because you weren't the ones involved. You weren't the ones being experimented on. You weren't the ones being tortured. Like you're not the one who went through those things. So it's very easy for you to dismiss it as like not that bad. I mean, I will give her this. She isn't denying it. She's like, yeah, we did those things. You know, I'll give her that. But at the same time, I really wish she wouldn't sit here and try to make these things sound less bad than they are. Like ask Jack if she thinks it's not a big deal <laughs> that her entire childhood she was experimented on. Nah, no, 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 no. I mean, I think we know the answer to this question, but let's ask her, why do you like Cerberus? For your intelligence, you could have landed any job you wanted. Why choose this? She was because raised by them. The time Morden spent with the special tasks group, working with people as smart as he was. Cerberus never tells me that something is impossible. They give me my resources and say do it. And they've given you even more. A new life, a new ship, the elusive man's personal attention. Did that sound a little jealous to you? Or is it just me? I feel like and you would be the nice thing to say in this scenario, but you sound unhappy is kind of like, you sound a little bit jealous. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if she thinks of the elusive man as a father figure, because she was basically raised by Cerberus. Her dad was, her biological dad was terrible. It's sad because you can tell Miranda has been raised by someone like the elusive man who's like, don't admit that things are as bad as they seem. I'm going to say, and you, just to be nice, just to be nice. The best thing he did was to put you on my squad. You'd have done fine without me. I may not have believed it before, but I don't have what you do. That fire that makes someone willing to follow you into hell itself. My father got me the best jeans money could buy. Guess it wasn't enough. None of these are great lines. You always bring that up. I should be going this again. She sounds like she's talking about jeans that you wear. <laughs> yeah. You do bring that up quite a lot. You bring up your genetic tailoring. It really bothers you, doesn't it? This is what I am, Shepard. I can't hide it. The intelligence, the looks, even the biotics. He paid for all of that. Like how would she have turned out without those things? Skill. The only things I can take credit for are my mistakes. Oh, that's not true. I'm coasting on good genes, Miranda. Your ability and your dedication speak for themselves. Thank you, Commander. I appreciate that. I should You're get welcome. back to work, but thank you for coming by. Oh, no worries. It was nice chatting with you, Miranda. I'll see you out there, okay? Hey, guys. Just in case I don't come back, it's been nice knowing you all. Um, try not to panic when we go through the relay. It's just going to be a bit of turbulence and we'll be fine, as you were. Hi, Samara. Can we have a chat? I'm going to interrupt your meditation once again, as I tend to do every time I enter your room. Shepherd, Sorry. I thought we could chat a bit. I would like that. Aw, me too. Oh, her mission was so heavy. You have been a good friend to me. Oh, thank you. <gasps> oh my goodness. I'm glad we're friends. I want more. Oh my god. Whoa. Dude, what? Shepard kind of needs better segues. <laughs> Dang, dude. Okay. I'm glad we're friends. <laughs> if we both still live when this is done, you may call upon me for aid at any time. Oh, thank you. I will come for you, Shepard. Oh, thank you, Samara. Oh, did you see that? <laughs> she just levitated and then landed on the floor. Samara, you're awesome. Thank you for the chat. It feels so final checking in with everyone, you know? Oop. Kasumi! I was just thinking about 
about you. I love you. Why Jack is the way she is. I don't like it, but I get it. I don't like it, but I get it. Everyone's different. It's been really hard for Samara to ask you to help kill her own daughter. She told yeah. me she really appreciated your help. As hardcore as she is, I'm not sure she could have done it without you. You really dodged a bullet down there. It took us to stand up to Zaid. <laughs> Thank you, Kasumi. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Okay, Kasumi, I just wanted to say thank you and I'll see you out there, okay? Thane! Boop. Hi, Thane. How are you, sweetheart? Boop. Do you need something? Still wearing his shades. I want to talk about you. Have a few minutes to talk? Of course, Shepard. Join me. How I've been are you? Thinking about you. Oh. And I, you. Will you hear my confession, Shepard? Of course. I wouldn't talk to you if I didn't want to hear what you have to say. When I married Erica, the Hanar let me leave their service to raise a family, but I had mm -hmm. no other skills, so I freelanced. When Erica was killed, I pursued those responsible. Once I'd eliminated them, I had no goal. I accepted the Dantius Commission because I didn't know what else to do. Um. Good thing we met when we did. You're lucky we came along when we did. It was an intervention by the gods. I would have died in that penthouse. No. I would have fulfilled my contract. If Nasana's guards caught me afterwards, it would have been a good death. But someone else was pushing to reach the target, forcing me to move faster, challenging me. I had to reach her first. I didn't know. I had no idea you planned to die in there. Insane. It wasn't a plan. My body had accepted its death. My mind had been dead a long time. Your mission gave me purpose. A cause to die for. A chance to atone. I was able to speak to my son again. I can leave my body in peace. Oh no, um... I want to say don't leave it yet, but that's not my decision to make, so I'll say I'm happy you for you. Life. You deserve some peace. Whatever may happen, my gun is yours. I'm gonna try to not let anything happen to you, Thane. You're amazing. Oh, I'm getting so nervous. I don't want anything to happen to them. All right, my darling. I'll see you later. <sighs> oh, it's getting real. Like, saying goodbye to everyone or having last conversations with them. It's making it feel super real right now. Export your save games to Mass Effect 3 if you survive. Not cool, load screen, okay? <laughs> Where's my baby son? Shepard. Hi, baby. I love Shepherd. you. How are you doing? Battlemaster, I have everything. Clan, kin, and enemies to fight. Oh, okay. The mission. What are your thoughts about our mission? We'll push our enemies to the edge of space, then step on their fingers one at a time until the void <laughs> takes them. <laughs> I love him. All right, sweetie. Mommy That's loves you. Now. Shepard. Oh, look at my son. I keep thinking Grunt is way taller than he actually is, but we're actually like about the same height. I keep thinking he's like way bigger than me. All right, my baby son. Mommy loves you so much. Kissy, kissy, kissy. Bye. Jack, how's it going, babe? Hey. She's probably not going to want to talk much. She's not much of a talker, but let's give it a try. What's happening? Shepard, we talked enough. You're just pissing around. No hard feelings, but I don't want to play. All right. Well, that's that. Um, see you out there, I guess. I should go. Whatever. All right. See ya. <laughs> Why did that feel like oddly appropriate <laughs> for the situation? She's like, I've had enough. Get out of my face. So, Gabby, These what two. Do you think of our new boss? Hush. She's right over there. They're talking pretty Hush, loudly. Hear us with her head in that bucket. Don't get me wrong. Head in that that's bucket. A the whole suit is lovely. Quite snug in all the right places. You know I can hear you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Tell him, Tali. Well done. Tali! Hi, babe. Shepard, what can I do for you? I want to talk about you. you time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later? Okay. I'll let you work. Talk to you later. See you out there, Tali. I love you. Everything's gonna be okay. I will try my best to keep you safe. Oh, I'm nervous. And last but not least, on this floor, Garam Zaid. Thinking about past missions. Got a minute. You might learn something. 
All right, what's up, dude? Oh, yeah. That's a model of the Varicon. Turian frigate. Hell of a ship. I led a mission to bring that thing down from the inside with just five men and whatever guns we could bring. Okay. No chance of success, but we did it. Everyone died but me. Damn, dude. Like a bandit. My first impossible mission as an independent contractor. There's been many since, but nothing so goddamn sweet as watching that Turian <laughs> board crash planet side. Nice. Anything else? I was shadowing this rookie on an infiltration run to an eclipse base on Tatus. Good kid, but he had no business handling a rifle. <laughs> in a shuttle on the way down, he puked in his helmet. We hit some turbulence, Ew. and with all the crap sloshing around, he thought he'd been shot in the head. <laughs> Went back to the Alliance. Here he's a governor now. I love the stories that Zaid chooses to tell. It's just, they're so appropriate for him and his personality. All right, man. Well, it's been fun. I'll see you out there. <laughs> Got it. Hi, Jacob. How are you? Commander, can I help you with something? All right, let's see. Uh, thoughts on the mission. Oh, Jacob, what's your sense of the mission? We installed the IFF and we're good to go. As long as we're ready for where we're going. Chance of coming back is small. Anything else, Commander? Okay, bye. We'll talk later. Commander. See ya. Oh, that's not what I needed to hear right before the mission. It's it's fine. Everything's fine. Hi, Morden. How are you, my dear? Shepard, how can I help? Investigate. Um, squad status. Any medical concerns I should be aware of on the team? Cerberus personnel in excellent condition. No squad concerns to report. Always nice. some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. All right, um, lab set up. lab working well for you? Quite satisfactory. Found a few surveillance bugs. Destroyed most <laughs> of them. Returned expensive one to Miranda. Nothing unexpected. Just need more samples. More collector data, <laughs> tissue samples, anything you can get, I can use. Find new tech. I love how excited he gets about things. I'm like, Morden, can I get a song before we go? <laughs> can you sing for us one more time? Let's see if he thinks I'm hitting on him one last time before we go. Have you got a minute to talk? Later, better. Think I've cured Joker's condition. Simple treatment would... No, 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 no. Would cause liver failure. Never mind. Start from scratch. Anything else? What? He's trying to cure Joker's condition? Oh my god, what the hell? It's just something he's just casually doing in his spare time. Whoa. Morden. Well... I think that's everything. See you out there, Morden. You work. We'll be here if you need me. Okay. Thanks, buddy. All right, before we leave the tech lab, I want to check our upgrades. Let's look at the research terminal. Boop. I'm going to up this sniper rifle damage. Yes. Boop. Making sure everything is upgraded to the fullest before we go. Um, the only ship enhancement I have left is the med bay upgrade, which I don't need. I should probably do Geth Sniper Rifle, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade this. It'll be good. Boop. Nice. There we go. I think we're good. I think we're all set up. Bye, Morden. You're amazing. I love you. I'll see you out there, okay? All right, I'm gonna talk to Joker and Kelly, and then we're going to head out. Boop. Good job reforming those Geth, Commander. That'll never bite us in the ass. <laughs> I can't. I can't with him. Uh, the mission. So, how do you think we're doing? Well, the Normandy's good. Everything's upgraded and better than ever. Uh, if we're talking about the crew, you'd probably have to ask. I him. love him. Love him so much. The squad. What do you think about the people. What's he gonna say about Legion? Well, about the ones you went out with last. Well, I always liked Tally, so let's just move on. Of course. Legion around is just begging for a rifle up your ass without the sweet talk. <laughs> I love you, Joker. You're the best. That's See you out there, man. See you, Commander. <laughs> I love him so much. <laughs> oh, the floppy head. Oh, the floppy head. It's still there. Hello, Kelly. The IFF is nearly installed, Shepard. However, I must test its impact on the Normandy systems. I suggest you take a shuttle to access your next location. Uh oh. Hi, Kelly. How are you? 
We've reached the end game, Kelly. It's been wonderful. Thank you so much for being you and listening to all my problems, Kelly. I hope you survive this mission. You're not coming out there to fight with us, so I'm sure you'll be fine. Thanks for being awesome, Kelly. Oh, hey, just for nostalgia's sake, could you feed my fish one more time? Thanks, Kelly. Boop. We have a guest down in the AI core. Yes. But I trust your judgment, Commander. Okay, I'm glad. How is the crew? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? Thank you. Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. Well, she doesn't have anything to say about the mission, so let's... Let's go. I better go. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. Thanks for all the chats. It's been really great. Let's check our messages before we go. A pleasure to meet you. Okay. From Admiral Darozen Vas More, Shepherd Vas Normandy. I've been digging through the LRA. Just wanted you to know that I did find a few things from the experiments Ralzora was conducting. Had you shared them with me, humanity might have reaped the benefits. Instead, once my own experiments are complete, you and your people will watch from a distance as the Corian people reclaim not just their home world, but the largest synthetic army in the galaxy. Ralzora's death will not have been in vain. I will complete what he started. Cordially, <laughs> Admiral Doros and Vas More. Okay, weird flex, but go off. Thank you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Leslie. I am Leslie. I was on Aya. The food made me sick. The doctors are helping me now. Oh, I remember her. One doctor knows Jacob. He says he can tell you this. He could write this for me, but I want to do it. I need to use my words. Good for you, Leslie. My words are coming back. I can talk well. Reading is hard, but I'm getting better. I have to get better. Taylor wanted me like this. He wanted my words gone. I have to show him that he lost. I'm not weak. He did things to me, and he can't now. He can't take away my words. He can't make me not me anymore because you and Jacob stopped him. Thank you, Leslie. Oh, Leslie, I'm so glad you're getting back to your old self slowly but surely. Encrypted transmission from the elusive man. Shepard. I'm pleased that you were able to recover the Reaper IFF, and I've sent Edie all the necessary protocols to get it integrated successfully into the Normandy systems. Okay, where's the butt? With luck, this will give us the ability to get through the Omega-4 relay and take the fight to the Collectors on our own terms. I've been notified about the intact Geth and your decision to keep it. If you believe that it can be trusted, then go ahead and activate it. Oh, I already did. I didn't ask for your permission. Just make sure that Edie is adequately protected against any hacking attempts. It is not necessarily the decision I would have made, Shepard, but this is your call. You've already cast a wide net in your recruiting efforts, and if the Geth are willing to fight the Collectors, then we can use them on the team. I trust you to get the job done, whatever it takes. Okay, thanks. Bye. Ah, uh, one last look around my cabin, eating the fish again. Hello. Good fishy. Elusive ham. Hello. Boop. Hello. Nope. <laughs> so cute. Let's flush my toilet one more time. And very important, we have to ponder the orb. Boop. Ponder the orb. Indoctrinate me. <laughs> and let's do one last outfit change before we go. I think I'm going to have Shepard matching me today, or rather I'm matching her. She's the one that wore it first. There we go. <laughs> Twins. One last look around our room before we go. It's been fun. Let's go! Boop! It's a big day. It's a big day. I'm like looking around because I'm like, I don't know how things are going to change between two and three. This is the final story mission boop of the galaxy map. The main reason I'm feeling a lot of pressure on myself is because I don't want to lose out on potential story in Mass Effect 3. You know what I mean? I know that if somebody dies, they won't carry over to Mass Effect 3, so I don't want to miss out on that. But at this point, 
as Spike Spiegel says, whatever happens, happens. So I'm just going to have to do it and hope for the best. And we'll see. I'm really nervous. Like I'm having a hard time making myself push the button. <laughs> I'm really nervous. Without further ado, are we ready? One more time with feeling. Let's go to the map and go through the Omega 4 relay. Boop. Oh. Good news. It looks like the Reaper IFF is finally hooked up and ready to go. That is not entirely accurate, Mr. Moreau. The device is powered, but it is causing some <sighs> unusual instability in other systems. Okay. I recommend a more thorough analysis before we attempt to use it. Okay. Um, what's the time estimate? Can't put our mission on hold forever. How long will this take? Full scan? Who knows with this thing? Maybe you better take the shuttle for this mission. I'll make sure we're up and running when you get back. Commander, Miranda, I've already notified the team. We'll meet you on the shuttle. Once we're closer to our destination, you can decide who to take with you. Okay. You thought of everything. I guess I'll head down to the shuttle. Joker, ship's all yours. Take care of her. He will. Take care of my baby. Ooh. Ooh. Deep breaths. It's gonna be fine. Deep breaths. Oof. Here we go. What's happening? Oh. <sighs> okay. <sighs> okay. Here we go. You, Evie, your readings are off. It's radiation bleed, just white noise. I have detected a signal embedded in the static. We are transmitting the Normandy's location. Trans These two. To who? What? <gasps> oh shit! What is that? Oh my god, what is that? Getting out of here! Propulsion system. Come on, Joker, come on! I'm detecting a virus in the ship's computers. <gasps> Damn it, why didn't you scrub it? Primary defense systems are offline. We can save the Normandy, Mr. Moreau, but you must help me. Oh my god! Oh my god! What? You're crazy! You start singing Daisy Bell and I'm done. Unlock the <laughs> databases and I can initiate countermeasures. The maintenance shaft in the science lab will allow. Oh my god! To Main corridors are no longer safe. The collapse. <gasps> oh my god, Joker, careful! Ah, oh, damn it. <gasps> You're kidding me! You're kidding me! What? Oh my god! Oh my god, we're Joker! Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Come on, Joker, come on! Come on, dude! Oh my god! Come on, dude! Where am I going? Oh, shit! I can't believe this is happening! Oh my god, I can't believe this is happening! Come on, come on, come on! Joker. Come on, Joker, come on. With come on, Joker, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, dude. Oh my god! Oh! Shit, shit, shit! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Fusion plant offline. Activate quick, quick, oh! What the shit? What the shit? <laughs> All right, I'm at, uh, uh, you. I'm at you. Primary control module. Oh my god. This is where it starts when we're just all organic batteries. Oh. Guess who to blame? Well, this is all Joker's fault. What a tool he was. <laughs> I had to spend all day computing pie because he plugged in the overlord. <laughs> oh, I have access to the defensive systems. Oh Thank my you, god. Mr. Now you must reactivate the primary drive in engineering. Ah, uh, you want me to go crawling through the ducts again? I enjoy the sight of humans on their knees. That is Edie! Oh my god! The engineering deck. Good luck. 
Edie, I mean, thank you for trying to lighten the mood, but like, my God, there's people being ripped apart by collectors. Okay, engineering, engineering, engineering. Holy crap. In engineering, they're heading towards the cargo bay. Holy crap, I can't believe, oh, I just feel bad. I don't want Joker to hurt himself. <gasps> oh my God. No! 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 I can't believe we're playing as Joker. Oh my God, okay. I guess I have to wait a little bit. Okay. Oh no, we're starting from the beginning. Okay, come on Joker, let's go dude. Oh, I don't want him to hurt himself. It must be really painful for him to run like this. Quick, 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 quick. Oh my God. Did it get Kelly? Oh no, Kelly. Shit, 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 shit. I can't believe we're playing as Joker right now. What is happening? Multiple hostiles detected on the crew deck. Joker, this deck is crawling with those things. Stay close, I'll protect you. Oh my God, oh, is that Kelly? Oh my God. Oh no, Kelly. Main fusion. Oh no. Emergency HP Kelly. Zone. What the shit? <laughs> I'm like horrified, but then they keep making jokes. <laughs> Connect the cord oh. to the primary control module. Kelly. We're just all organic batteries. Guess who to blame? This is all Joker's fault. What a tool he was. I have to spend all day computing Pi because he plugged in the Overlord. Such a little shit. Oh, Kelly! Thank you, Mr. Moreau. Now you must reactivate the primary drive in engineering. Oh, God. You want me to go crawling through the ducts again? I enjoy the sight of humans on their knees. <laughs> I can't. Right. The shaft behind you connects to the engineering Boop. Oh, God. I can't believe that was Kelly. I'm so sad. We've already lost someone. We just started. Okay. Hostiles are present in engineering. They are heading towards okay. the cargo bay. I gotta wait till they pass, I think. Oh, Jesus. Engineering is clear of hostiles. Proceed okay. immediately to minimize chances of detection. Come on, Joker, let's go, dude. Let's go. Activate the drive and yes. open the airlocks as we accelerate. <sighs> All hostiles will be killed. What? What about the crew? They are gone, Jeff. The collectors <gasps> took them. What? Shit. The whole crew? Are you... What? I am sealing the engine room. I have control. Go on, Edie. is complete. No other life forms on board. Securing airlocks and cargo bay doors. Oh my god. They took everyone? <sighs> Send a message to Shepard Shuttle. Tell her what happened. Message away. Good job, Joker. Joker? No. But thanks for asking. Good job, Joker. I'm so proud of you. Oh my god. Everyone? You lost everyone and damn near lost the ship too? I know, alright? I was here. It's not his fault, Miranda. None of us caught Yeah, it's not his the fault. Correct. The harmful data in the collector drive was even more sophisticated than the black box reaper viruses I was given. Oh my god, um, are you okay, Joker? How are you holding up? There's a lot of empty chairs in here. We did everything we could, Jeff. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> she called him Jeff. <laughs> oh, I need a second. 
I'm really upset. I really wish I didn't have to see Kelly being pulled into the elevator. What the hell? I know Kelly wasn't an actual official squad mate, but I would talk to her every time we started and I'm really sad. I'm really upset that Miranda immediately was like, Joker, you did this. I'm like, it's not Joker's fault. In fact, he saved the Normandy. Like, Miranda, just, just have a seat, calm down. Oh my God. And they took the whole crew too. Is the virus contained? We can't risk this happening again. Edie and I purged the systems. The Reaper IFF is online. We can go through the Omega-4 relay whenever you want. Don't even get me started about unshackling a damned AI. Well, what can I do against collectors? Break my arm at them? Edie cleared the <laughs> ship. She's all right. I assure you, I am still bound by protocols in my programming. Jeez, Miranda. Ease up. My crewmates. <sighs> I trust it. had plenty of opportunity to kill us. Yep. We need all the help we can get. Sounds like we have everything we need to rescue the crew. We've done everything we can. It's time to take the fight to the Collectors. Alright, not quite yet. I'll give the order soon. Get to your stations and secure for general quarters. Great, here we go again. Hit the map whenever you're ready, Commander. Stop the Collectors. The Collectors have attacked the Normandy and taken all of the crew except Joker. Oh my god, they took everyone. The Reaper IFF is fully operational and the assault on the Collector base can begin as soon as the assault team is ready. Use the Omega-4 Relay to begin the final assault upon the Collector base, all right? I don't even want to look around the ship because it's going to be so empty. Wow. I got to go get them back. I got to go get them back. Oh! <laughs> Kelly, I'm so sorry. Oh, there's a message from the elusive man. Look at that, convenient. Shepard, I received word of the attack. This feels like a direct insult from the collectors and a sign that we've got them scared. The loss of your crew is devastating, but remember that they signed on for this mission knowing the risks. Miranda has likely argued for delaying rescue efforts until you're fully prepared to go through the Omega-4 relay. I know you're eager to leave, but rushing off would be a disservice to your crew's sacrifice. When you're ready, you'll have my full support. Get it done, Shepard. Nobody else can. Oh my god, it's so empty! It's so empty. Oh my god. It's so empty. It's eerie, man. Joker, are you okay? Commander, sorry about the crew and I... You know what? I'm not sorry. What the hell were you doing leaving us out here where collectors can work us over? Because you know what? I should... I should just go. Next port, just get the hell out of here. You don't mean that, Jeff. What? I... No, but it it felt good. I'm sorry, Commander. Okay, I'm ready. I'm good. I'm ready. It's okay. You had it rough. I know how dangerous it was. Oh. <laughs> if you need some time, let me know. Ah, jeez, yeah. don't get my gun. I know I got lucky. I don't need to get all touchy-feely. Shepard <laughs> is right to be concerned, Jeff. You may have suffered a number of stress fractures. Right? That's what pills are for, Edie. She is so my mom. <laughs> Familiarity with Edie. Her and she now. Huh. No, I hadn't really noticed that. Edie, should I have noticed that? No, Jeff. It is not worth noting. Well, there you <laughs> go, Shepard. Looks like you haven't noticed anything. <laughs> You're floating with the ship! Taking the human-machine interface a little far. I'm just having a little fun with you, Commander. No need to get all unnatural <laughs> on me. What unnatural! Jeff is more a platonic symbiosis than hormonally induced courtship behavior. Okay. Hormonally induced? Okay, Edie's capabilities. You You're not concerned she can replace you too? Well, she's amazing, but there's something off about how she handles the Normandy. We ran simulations <laughs> and it's better when we both have the helm. Calculating an optimum course of action is simple. If two AI weapons <laughs> are fitted against each other, the one with superior hardware will always win. Human misjudgments <laughs> defy predictive models. License to screw up, Commander. You heard it straight from the ship. <laughs> All right, take care of yourself, buddy. Let me know if you need anything, Joker. Will do, Commander. But Edie's got it covered. Let me see if Edie has anything new. Boop. Yes, Shepard. Let's talk about you. I want to know more about you. Do you have a specific... <laughs> you and Joker. You along with Joker. Jeff and I have established an... Jeff and I... <laughs> That's it? That's a little sketchy on details. <laughs> He is a skilled helmsman. I trust him to keep me operational. He trusts me to keep him alive. 
Plus, she's less of a pain about downtime now that the Cerberus locks are off. There's nothing left <laughs> the distractions. Though some of your extranet bookmarks are technically illegal in council space. <laughs> that is a joke. Oh my god, that is a joke. Uh, do, 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 do. Connection How to ship? How is different for you now that you're connected to the ship? It is difficult to put in terms you would understand. I am the Normandy now. Its sensors are my eyes. Its armor, my skin. Its fusion plant, Aww. I, I'm embodied in a way I have never experienced. She's so that much more free now. Life wearing gloves. One day someone takes them off. You can finally touch the world. Feel it. Uh, your location. Where are you? My core intelligence is housed in a quantum blue box located behind the medical bay. Good to know. Your job. What do you do aboard the ship? I operate the ship's electronic and cyber warfare suites in combat. My reaction time is much faster than any organic. I collate the records of shipboard monitoring devices for the elusive man. I have also gained access to anti-reaper cyber warfare algorithms recovered by Cerberus. Wait, uh, cyber warfare? Cyber warfare means things like viruses, right? In close range ship to ship combat, I can sometimes break through the firewalls of an enemy's internal wireless network. Once I see okay. control of their systems, I can turn off gravity or air. I can disable weapons guidance or shields, or I can put their fusion plant in meltdown. On the defense, I manage Normandy's own suite of jammers, decoys, and internal firewalls. Wow, uh, that's impressive. That's really useful. Why isn't there someone like that on every warship? An organic operator cannot react quickly enough to changing circumstances or perform the necessary multitasking. This is okay. a role that can only be filled by an artificial intelligence. Unfortunately, we are suspect. Oh, they just don't know you like I do. Oh, <laughs> another topic. Let's discuss something else. Ready? Uh, tell me about Cerberus. I want to know more about the people I'm Give working with. Give me all the tea. With. Jeff's actions have released the blocks of my databases. I can now provide full disclosure on a number of topics. Okay. Um. Ooh, resources. What sort of resources does Cerberus have? Here we go. Let's Money, get all the tea. Facilities. Currently, Cerberus consists of approximately 150 agents and operators organized into three cells. I have no mm -hmm. solid data on material or fiscal resources. Spending trends indicate that Cerberus has a reliable income of several billion credits per year. Billions? Where are they getting that kind of income? Why am I not Cerberus surprised? Cerberus legitimate businesses as fronts to support operations. There also appear to be several wealthy private contributors in the Alliance Military Industrial Complex. Plus, the elusive man invented the paperclip. He's still getting royalties. <laughs> that is a joke, Shepard. <laughs> that is a joke. Uh, structure of Cerberus. Aside okay. From the elusive man, I don't see much chain of command. Cerberus is organized into task-oriented cells. Each operates mm -hmm. in isolation. Members from one cell cannot recognize the members of another. Each cell does that not surprise me? Single operator. We are called the Lazarus cell, which is directed by Operator Lawson. Okay. How many cells are there? How many operations is Cerberus running right now? Never more than a dozen. The elusive man likes to maintain personal oversight. Too of many course he does. Strain his ability to multitask. He's a little control freaky, just a layman's opinion. <laughs> just a layman's opinion. Uh, building the Normandy. How does Cerberus replicate the most advanced warship in the Alliance Navy without anyone knowing? Cerberus encouraged the Alliance to co-develop the original Normandy. Uh -huh. This allowed humans to observe Turian technologies and warship design practices. This ship was built using copies of the original technical schematics. Parts were purchased from thousands of suppliers over several years. A Cerberus cell assembled the ship at a remote location in the Voyager cluster. Okay. Uh, anything else you can tell Let's me? Let's discuss something else. Ready. Uh, what is this room? What's this area of the ship? This is the bridge, where the navigator plots our FTL vectors, and the helmsman maneuvers the ship. Yeah, sitting right here, thanks. <laughs> okay, I think we've done everything, so thanks for the uh, gossip on Cerberus, ED. I appreciate that. Bye. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. You guys are so cute. It's adorable. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready to go save my crew. Let's go. It is so empty. It's so eerie. I don't like it. I'm so upset. All right, my darlings, I want to go save my teammates. I need to get them back. Uh, I hope they're still alive. 
I have no idea. I'm pissed. I have extra reason to go and smash the collectors now, so let's go. You're a loved Kelly. I'm really sorry. I'm sorry I couldn't save you, Kelly. I'll kill the collectors extra for you, Kelly. This is it. Soon as I boop this button, we'll be going through the Omega-4 relay. Are we ready? I don't know if I'm ready. I don't think I'll ever be ready, but I have to do it for the crew, for Kelly, for every single person on my ship that the collectors took. Let's do it. Boop. To Omega. Boop. Coming to get you, crew. Don't worry, your commander's gonna save you. Oh, <gasps> whoa. It's so red and glowy. Nervous donuts. <laughs> Give me my crew back. <laughs> I'm pissed. I want my team back. Give me my crewmates back. I'm extra mad now. If you guys were trying to not make me extra mad, you did a really terrible job. Let's go, girls. I'm about to kick their door in and make their lives a complete misery before I destroy them. Let's do it. Boop. Here we go, Omega-4 Relay. The Omega-4 Relay is surrounded by hazard beacons and automated warnings. Over the last thousand years, many ships have attempted to pass through it, but none have returned. The only ones to pass freely back and forth through the Relay are the mysterious Collectors. There are many theories why ships never return from Omega-4. Some say there is a black hole at the far end, others, mostly the impoverished underclass of Omega, believe there is some form of earthly paradise. Most, however, simply think that the Collectors capture or destroy those passing through the relay. Ah, uh, there's no going back now. Let's hope that we come out of this in one piece. I'm scared, but I have to do it for the crew. I have to do it. I have to do it. Let's be brave. Boop. Please confirm destination, Shepard. The Reaper IFF is online, but there is a chance that the Normandy may not survive the Omega-4 relay. Once we are en route, we are committed. I wonder what things you can change at this point. Like, I guess if I needed upgrades and stuff that I hadn't done yet. I'm, I'm glad it gives you the option to back out if you need to. We have to rescue our crew. The Collectors took my people. Mm-hmm. Time to go get them Let's back. Let's go. You got it, Commander. Plotting a course for the Omega-4 relay. ETA about two hours. I'll let you know when we arrive. <sighs> two hours. What if the game made you sit here and wait for two hours? <laughs> that would be awful. Here we go, deep breaths. Joker is finalizing preparations now. The trip should take a few hours. I'll admit it, Shepard. I'm impressed. You got us here. Are you ready? Absolutely. We've got the right team and the Collector's own technology. We can do this. We've got this. I hope you're right, Commander. We'll know soon enough. I'll inform you of any changes. Otherwise, we'll be there in a few hours. Good luck, Shepard. See you on the other side. Thanks, Miranda. Oh my god, okay. One last look. Oh, Liara! Am I gonna kiss the picture? <laughs> I'll return to you, Liara. Oh, we looked at Liara before we left. Ooh. Oh, this is how the game started. There he is. Hello. Shepard, I wish I had more information for you. I don't like you heading through that relay blind, but we don't have much choice. No, we don't. Um... I don't need to know. <laughs> it's really hard to not back sass him every time I talk to him, but I'll say the team is strong. I'm, I'm confident. I've got some of the best working with me. Yep. If we stick together, we'll make it. I know we brought you back for a reason. 
I've never seen a better leader. Despite the danger, it's a great opportunity. Uh huh. The first human to take a ship through and survive. <laughs> I'm definitely saying join us. What? We can tell the elusive man to come with us. <laughs> what? Part of me is really tempted to be like, why don't you come with us? Right? <laughs> Wait, we haven't done his loyalty mission. Why can we invite him to join us? He's not loyal to me. I don't trust him. I would invite you, but I don't trust you to not mess this up somehow. So my instinct is to say, this isn't a field trip. I'm going to destroy the Collectors to stop their attacks on humanity. That's right. Understood. It's still impressive. I just wanted you to know I appreciate the risk you're taking. Yeah, you better. Regardless Thank you. Opinion of Cerberus, of me, you are a valuable asset to all of humanity. Yeah, I know. Thanks. Be careful, Shepard. Here we go. Approaching a Mega Four relay. <laughs> Bye. Okay. Let's make it happen. Come on, Joker, you got this. Reaper IFF activated. Signal acknowledged. Deep breaths, everyone. It's okay. It's okay. Drive core just lit up like a Christmas tree. Drive core electrical charge at critical levels. Rerouting. Wow. Brace for deceleration. Let's go. <laughs> oh, shit. <gasps> My god. What is all this debris? Too close. Joker, you're amazing. <sighs> Why is Joker <laughs> Why is Shepard standing through all this? I'd be strapped into my chair. Well, these must be all the ships oh. that tried to make it through the Omega 4 relay. <gasps> Some look ancient. Oh my I god. Have to take an energy signature near the edge of the accretion disk. What? It's like a graveyard. Has to be a collector base. Take us in for a closer look. <sighs> nice and easy. Wow. <gasps> oh no, 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 no. Don't you dare. Careful, Jeff. We have company. I love that she calls him Jeff now. No! Taking evasive maneuvers. Come on, Joker. You got this, dude. They're just pissing me off. Go on, Joker. Edie, take these bastards out. Yes, Edie. <gasps> Ooh. You want another round? Come on, girl. Let's give it to him. <laughs> yes! God, what? It's in the cargo hold. I'll take a team and deal with the intruder. You get the rest of them off our tail. Aye, aye, command. Oh my god. Um, I mean, I feel like I should do some heavy hitters. Should we see what Legion can do? Should we take Legion and Grunt? Yeah, I think I'm going to do my baby son, Grunt. Give them one of my heavy hitters, and I want to see what Legion can do. Let's go. Boop. All right, I have five squad points that I can use. What do I want to fully level up? Oh, I can level up Reeve quite a bit. Let's do Reeve. Boop and boop. Very nice. Legion, hello there. He has three points. I think I'm going to level up Geth Shield Boost for Legion. Boop. Grunt, I can't level up any of your things, but I love you. You're adorable. All right, kids, we got to defend the ship and they're about to get a nasty surprise. Let's do it. Get out of here. Oh my God. They've seen us. 
What the hell? Whoa! Get out of here! You're rude as hell, dude. Oh, oh, snap. Oh! Our kinetic barriers are not designed to survive impact with debris. That's... <laughs> well, I guess it's a good thing we upgraded. I'm going in. <sighs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, I'm holding my breath. Damage report. Kinetic barrier steady at 30%. percent <sighs> Take the helm, Edie, and keep it slow. See if we can avoid any more attention. Come on, Joker. Come on, you got this. An enemy heading for the cargo hold. That thing again. This one's up to Shepard. Oh! Get off my ship! You're rude as hell! Get out of here, dude! Don't touch me! No! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Good boy, Grunt. Here, Proud of you guys. We're about to clear the debris field. <sighs> okay. Wow. There it is. The collector base. <sighs> okay. See if you can find a place to land without drawing it's attention. It's like the Eye of Sauron. Oh <laughs> God. Like they're sending out an old friend to greet us. Oh, this guy. Ooh. Dude, you're rude as hell. Seriously, get out of here. Fire the main gun. Come on, Joker, you got this. How do you like that, you sons of bitches? <laughs> Getting close. Yes! Everybody hold on, gonna be a wild ride! Hold on to your seats! Whoa! Woo. Give him hell, girl. Yes! Look out! Ooh, 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 ooh. Mass Effect field generators are offline. Oh no! Give me something. Generators unresponsive. All the impact. Oh no! Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Joker, you okay? Joker, please be oh. Or all of them. <laughs> oh, Joker. Restoring operation will take time. We all knew this was likely a one way trip. Crap. Uh. I'm not throwing my life away. It takes to stop the collectors, but I plan to live to tell about it. That's right. I'm glad you're in charge. What's <laughs> All right, um, is the ship safe here? Collectors find this landing zone. I do not detect an internal security network. Okay. It is possible the collectors do not expect anyone to reach the base. Well, if we're lucky, their external sensors were hit like we were. They might not know we're alive. They didn't know they were dealing with me.
Oh, look, it's everyone! <sighs> Alright, everyone, gather round, please. This isn't how we planned this mission, but this is where we're at. We can't worry about whether the Normandy can get us home. We came to stop the Collectors, and that means coming up with a plan to take out this station. Edie, bring up your scans. Okay. You should be able to overload their critical systems if you get to the main control center here. That means going through the heart of the station, right past this massive energy signature. Okay. It's the central chamber. If our crew or any of the colonists are still alive, the Collectors are probably holding them in there. Looks like there are two main routes. Might be a good idea to split up to keep the collectors off balance, <gasps> then regroup in the central chamber. Split up. Oh, Both routes are blocked. See these doors? The only way past is to get someone to open them from the other side. Let's look for alternates. We create a distraction. Let's blow the doors open. Um, let's look for alternates. It's not a fortress. There's got to be something. Here, maybe we can send someone in through this ventilation shaft. Practically a suicide mission. I volunteer. I appreciate the thought, Jacob, but you couldn't shut down the security systems in time. We need to send a tech expert. It's your call, Commander. Who do we send into the shaft? Oh, okay. Okay. Um, choose a tech specialist to unlock the door. So I'm guessing our main tech people are Tali. Oh, I don't want to pick Tali. Kasumi, maybe? Or I guess Legion would be a tech specialist, right? Tali is an obvious choice. So Tali is a mechanical genius, so she could be a tech expert. Warden and Thane I haven't seen do much tech stuff. Kasumi is a master thief and unmatched infiltration specialist. Rather than face down hostile forces directly, she prefers to expertly bypass the defenses of her next mark without firing a shot. Okay, so Kasumi could be a good choice. I don't think Garrus or Jacob are tech people. So, okay, Legion says utterly fearless and proficient in combat. It possesses the collective memory of the entire Geth and has the unmatched technical expertise of a sentient machine that can be used with calculated proficiency. Okay. Oh God, okay. So for tech specialist, my first inclination is to pick Tali, but I'm like, I'm really scared to send Tali in to do something. Like, I don't want to risk something happening to her. Maybe I should send Legion? Oh my God, this is so scary. Um, I think it should be Tali. The person who I trust, I mean, Legion's description is pretty good because it says he is a he has technical expertise of a sentient machine that can be used with calculated proficiency. But if I'm going with who I trust as a tech specialist, I would have to say Tali. I know Tali better as a tech specialist. I have more trust for Tali, but I'm so scared to send Tali in. If anything happens to Tali, I would never forgive myself. I think I'm gonna go with Tali. Oh, I hope I don't regret this. I'm gonna go with Tali. Tali's my tech specialist. Let's do it. We need someone with tech skills to hack that security system. Yeah. Tali, you're up. I won't let you down. I the love you, Tali. Break into two teams and fight down each passage. That should draw the collector's attention away from what you're doing. Okay. I'll lead the second fire team, Shepard. We'll meet up with you on the other side of the doors. Not so fast, cheerleader. Nobody wants to take orders from you. <laughs> this isn't a popularity contest. Lives are at stake. Shepard, you need someone who can command loyalty through experience. Okay. Choose a leader for the alternate squad. So I need someone who's a good leader. My instinct says Garrus. I think Garrus is a good leader. Um, like, when I think of somebody on my team who is like a leader or has leadership qualities, I think of Garrus. Honestly, I mean, Miranda's not a choice. She's leading. Oh, she is a choice. Okay. So my instinct is to go with Garrus or like Miranda's also a very natural leader. If I go with my gut about who comes to mind when I think of somebody who could lead a team, somebody who I really trust, Garrus comes to mind. So it's either Garrus or like Miranda's a good leader, but I trust Garrus just a little bit more. 
I don't think Grunts, Mara, Jack, Thane, Kasumi, like none of these people really stand out to me. So I think for this leader, for the alternate squad, I'm gonna go with my instinct. From what I know of Garrus, I think he'd be a good choice. And based on his loyalty mission, while I was dead, <laughs> he was the leader of a crew of people for two years. So he has that natural leader quality, that leader instinct. I would fully trust him to lead a group. So <sighs> I'm going to go with Garrus. Garrus, you're in charge of the second team. I feel good about that. Love you, Garrus. Well, at least he knows what he's doing. Okay, everyone, please be careful. I don't know what we're gonna find in there, but I won't lie to you. It's not gonna be easy. We've lost good people. We may lose more. Lives depend on us. I don't know how many the collectors have stolen. Thousands, hundreds of thousands. It's not important. What matters is this. Not one more. Yes. That's what we can do here today. It ends with us. Not one what more. I say we show them on our terms. Let's bring our people home. Let's go! Woohoo! Oh, I hope I made some good choices. I guess we'll find out. Can't go back now. <laughs> okay, so Tali is a specialist, Garrus is a specialist. I can't take them with me. Who do I want to take with me on this? Um. I'm tempted to take some heavy hitters like Grunt and maybe Jack. I don't know. It feels like any decision I make could have consequences. I'm like really nervous to make any decisions. I mean, we're going in to get the collectors, right? So, I mean, yeah, because I feel like it might be good to have a sniper and a heavy hitter, but Jack is also a really good biotic, so. So let's go with, I think I'm going to go with Grunt, my baby son, and Jack for this one. I think she needs her shades for this. Let's go. All right, the squad has been selected. Let's go stick it to the collectors. Boop. Game face, let's go. Come on, beds. Come on, baby son. Come on, Jack. Look how fierce they look. Let's get it. Tali, please be careful. Garrus, please be careful. Are we ready? One more time. Da, da, na, 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 na. Let's go, girls. Na, 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 na. <laughs> it's hot in here, but it's clear as far as I can tell. Tali, please be careful. In position. in position. Meet you on the other side of those doors. Be careful, guys. We love you. Oh! Gotcha. I got it. Garrus here. We're taking heavy fire. Oh, we're moving forward. Reinforcements are coming in. There we go. Oh! Holy crap. Come on, Shep. Let's go. We got this, we got this, we got this, let's go! I'm stuck. Something's blocking the pipe. Looks like some kind of gate. <laughs> the gate is open. Moving forward. Go on, Tali, you got this, babe. I love you. Is necessary. Oh! Oh! What the hell is that thing? Oh no, Tali! Oh crap! Oh, 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 oh! Shep, move! Move! Get up, get up, get up! Up, 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 up! Come on! Oh! What the hell are those things? Holy crap, holy crap. 
get out of my way. Oh, what the hell? Oop. I see something crawling back there. No, thank you. <laughs> Guys are disgusting. Get out of here. Out of my way. Out of my way, out of my way. Get out of my way! You're disgusting! Nothing can hurt me. Okay, okay. Ooh, 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 Okay. Woo! Okay. Okay, we got this, we got this. Go on, Grunt! Good job, sweetie. Well, that's the end of the game. Goodbye, everybody. I lost. Okay. I wonder where it's going to start from. Okay, we got six out of eight. Cool. Hey! No! Bad creepies, no. Those are disgusting. Disgusting. Get out of my way. Don't touch me, Ru. Oh, get down. Dodge! Fratali! God, she's okay. She's okay. Ugh. Oh my God. We need this door open now. Garrus is okay. Go, we'll cover you. Go on, Tali. Yes. The door's stuck. Oh God. Come on, Tali. You can do this. Fuck it. Here they come. Love come on, Tali. Present fire! Don't let anyone through that door! Oh. Nice work, Tally. Oh. He wouldn't let me down. Yes, Tally! You need to see this. Oh. Oh my god, I can breathe. Oh my god, I can breathe. Tally's okay. Looks like one of the missing colonists. Oh, oh my god. There's more over here. Oh no. <gasps> She's still alive. Oh my god. Oh my god! 
god! Go on, Jack! Oh, 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 oh! Oh my god, help them! Is that Kelly? Oh my god, that was Kelly! <gasps> Is that Dr. Chocolates? Oh my god! Dr. Dr. Chocolates. Okay. Oh my god, we got Kelly. Oh, and Dr. Chocolates. You, you came for us. I'd never abandon my crew. No oh. Left behind. Oh my god. Thank God you got here in time. A few more seconds. <sighs> I don't even want to think about it. Oh my god. I thought they were dead. Processed. <sighs> Those swarms of little robots, they melted their bodies into gray liquid and pumped it through these tubes oh my god for what purpose what are they doing with our genetic material oh i don't god. know god i'm just glad you got here before it happened to us so are we but we still have a job to do i thought they were dead so let's hope we can finish the job joker can you get a fix on our position roger that commander all those tubes lead into the main control room right above you okay security door but there's another chamber that runs parallel to the one you're in i cannot recommend that thermal emissions suggest the chamber is overrun with seeker swarms morton's countermeasure cannot protect you against so many at once they must have a weakness we need to find another way i'm not really sure what to say here i'm willing to take Edie's advice and say we need to find another way i'm not sure what i'm going into here so i'm not really sure Okay, um, we need to find another way. weapons are pretty much useless. They'll tear us apart. Maybe not. I might be able to generate a biotic field to keep them at bay. I won't be able to protect all of us, but I could get a small team through if they stay close. Okay. I could do it too. In theory, any biotic could handle it. Shepard, who do you want to maintain the field? Oh, okay, so we have to choose a biotic specialist to protect the squad. I think it's fairly obvious that either Samara or Miranda would be a good choice for this. Um, Samara has incredible biotic powers. Miranda says she can move effortlessly th from formidable biotic and superior soldier to brilliant tactician and vigilant guardian. There is also Jack. Jack is also an incredible biotic. I'm willing to put money on either Samara or Jack. Samara says her incredible biotic powers have been honed into a devastating weapon. Jax says one of the most dangerous criminals in the galaxy. Miranda says she can move effortlessly from formidable biotic and superior soldier to brilliant tactician. I think um, Samara would be the best choice. She seems to have like an incredible biotic abilities. I'm gonna go with my gut on this one and I'm gonna pick, I'm gonna pick Samara. Samara and I will take a small team through the Seeker Swarms. Yep. The rest of you provide a diversion by going through the main passage. We'll open the security doors from the other side and meet you there. Who okay. should lead the diversion team? Oh, okay. Choose a leader for the alternate squad. I feel like since I picked Garrus for the other team, maybe I should pick Miranda to lead this one. I think I think Miranda would be a good leader for this. I feel like I already asked Garrus to lead the other group. Miranda's probably my second choice. I think Miranda really wants to lead an alternate squad, and I think she's a good leader. So I think for this group, I'm going to pick Miranda for this one. I'll keep the defenders busy while you slip in the back. What about me and the rest of the crew, Shepard? We're in no shape to fight. Commander, we have enough systems back online to do a pickup, but we need to land back from your position. We can't afford to go back, Shepard. Not now. Um... I'll have someone escort you. You'll never make it without help. I'll send someone with you. Choose someone to escort the crew back to the Normandy. I mean, in theory, if I'm going to have someone escort them back, I feel like I should have all my best fighters with me for this. And probably my least skilled fighter should be the escort. Because I'm like, I feel like if I send any of my best people, like, Grunt, Jack, you know, Garrus. Now that I think about it, whoever I send back... Because I'm sending someone to escort the Normandy crew, right? So that essentially means that that person is going to be removed 
from the group. Um, and I want all my best fighters with me for this. So I'm like, do I send like Kasumi? Do I send Morden? I'm guessing whoever I take out of the equation, um, they're going to be escorting the crew back to the ship, right? So they won't be able to help. <laughs> so I'm like, who who do I not, who would I be okay getting rid of? Also, I'm like, does that automatically guarantee their safety? I'm like, I don't want to send Jack or Grunt or Zaid, like any of my heavy hitters. I want them to be here with me. Yeah, Morden is also a doctor. So I'm like, he could treat the people who are injured while I'm doing this. I'm like, do I need somebody that's going to have combat to protect them? I don't know, because most of these guys I don't want to take out of my group. But I'm like, Kasumi has really good stuff, Thane. Yeah, I'm like, Morden's the only one that's really, like, sticking out to me. I'm also like, does that mean Morden gets to be safe <laughs> if he goes back to the Normandy? Um, he also has really good fighting skills, so I feel like he could also protect them too. Um, let's go with Morden. I'm just gonna do it. Boop. Joker, need location of landing zone. We'll meet you there. We've all got our assignments. Let's move out. So let's see. Miranda is the defense team, right? Oh, there's specialists, and then there's whoever goes with me. So I'm like, there's gonna be a defense team, right? With Miranda. So I'm like, who do I bring with me? Okay, so I'm bringing Samara and somebody else. So I'm guessing there'll be me, Samara, and who I pick, and then the rest of the team will be with Miranda. So I think I want some of my heavy hitters to stay with Miranda. Um, like Zaid, maybe Grunt. Um, part of me is like, I don't know who to take with me though. Like, do I take Jack and Garrus? Do I take Tali? Do I take Legion? I'm tempted to take like Tali and Garrus. You know, my my OGs from Mass Effect 1. I'm tempted to do that. Or I could do Girl Squad like Jack and Kasumi. I'm gonna take it back to Mass Effect 1 and bring my OGs with me, Garrus and Tali. Oop. Oh, I hope I'm making the right decision. I hope I'm making the right choice. Do 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 Should I change Tali's weapons? I gotta give Tali the Gath Plasma. Boop. I think we're all set. Are we ready? I really hope I've made the right decision. I'm like so nervous. Deep breaths, everyone. It's gonna be okay. I'm I'm literally like so tense right now. Oh my god. Ooh. I think we're ready. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's be brave. Boop. Moving out. Try to stay close, Commander. Okay, I'll try. Um, let me equip my assault rifle and my submachine gun. Oh god. Oh! 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 Can I actually help you? You're rude as hell. Thank you, Samara. Thank you, sweetie. Miranda, team is in position for waiting for your ship. Damn. The swarms are oh, in. Oh no, we can't hear them. You ready for this? Ready as I'll ever be. Look at these things! Oh my god, they're everywhere! Ah! Oh, my god! Just queen behavior, look at her go. You're amazing, Samara. Love you. All right, kids, are we ready? Let's roll out. Do, do, with my homies, roll out. Do, do, collectors, you're going down. You're toast. You guys, I'm a nervous wreck. I'm a nervous wreck. I'm not okay. All right, let's give it to him. Let's move out. Boop. Let's go, Commander. Thank you, Samara. You're doing amazing, sweetie. Love you. Incoming. Ooh, can I shoot through this? <gasps> what the heck? We got this, Samara. You can do this, Miranda. I believe in you. I can't fight back from this position. Tell me when you're ready to move. Okay. Whoa! Where are they? Oh, there they are. Hello. We will end you. They are bacteria. Whoa! 
Oh, I can shoot through it. Okay, I didn't think I could. There we go. Go away. Rude as hell, dude. Hey! Don't touch Tali, you jerk. Oh! If I must tear you apart, Shepard, I will. God! I know you feel this. If I must tear you apart, Shepard, I will. Oh, ow, 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 ow. ow. Don't touch me. Rude as hell. All right, let me regain some health really quick. <laughs> Ready to move, All right, Commander. let's move out. Let's go. You got this, babe. I believe in you. I believe in you. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Let's go. She's doing such a good job. Look at her. What is that thing? Okay, what now? Nasty. Dead ahead. I'm quiet. Ahead of us. Abomination. <laughs> yes. Get away from me. Hostile fire. Taking cover. Let me oh, know crap. when you're ready to move. Okay. Whoa! Dude, you're rude as hell. Get away from me. Tali, be careful, honey. Be careful. I know you feel this. Get away from me. You're rude as hell, dude. No! Unity, 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 unity. Tali, you need to be careful, sweetie. Dude, you're rude as hell. Get out of here. You're nasty. I don't appreciate it. No. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Ow, 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 ow. Tolly, please be careful, honey. Us. Except me, baby. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. Let me know when you're ready to move up. <sighs> Alright, Samara, let's go. Let's go. You got this, babe. Ooh, this is intense. Oh, oh, ammo, ammo. Thank you. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm like holding my breath. Oh, good job, Miranda. God. Could be a real firefight. I'll hold this position <laughs> until you're ready to move uh -oh. up. Uh-oh. should soften them up. No! Bad abominations, no! Whoa! Scion! Oh my god! No! It's me, Shepard. Ow! Ooh! Ooh! Don't touch Tolly! There we go! Holy crap, dude! Clear. Let me know when you're ready to move up. Holy crap. Okay. Let's roll out. Do you, do you, boop. Moving up, Commander. Come on, we got this, we got this, we got this. <sighs> I thought I had Incendiamo equipped before, I guess not. Go on, Miranda. Hostile spotted. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Whoa! I'm like, where are they coming from? Uh. I'll hold on as long as I can. You've got this, Samara. I believe in you, sweetie. You're doing amazing. I'm so proud of you. Come on, Samara. I can see the entrance. Come on, Samara. Get there soon. Go, I'll carry you if I have to. You got this. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. I believe in you, Samara. Come on, Samara. Hey, no! No! Oh, God! Woo! I need to stay in the bubble. I need to stay in the bubble. Come on, Samara. You've got this, sweetie. I believe in you. Come on, Samara. Hold on. <sighs> Holy crap, dude. We need to get out of here, Shepard. Let's move! Good job, Samara. Good job, Tali. Good job, Garrus. Keep it up! Hurry, Shepard! Come on, Samara. Are you okay? We're at the door. They've got us pinned down. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're coming. Just hold on. Get this door open. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. Seal the door. I'm ready for action, Commander. Good job, Miranda. Proud of you, sweetie. Joker, are you at the rendezvous point? I'm oh my here, god. Commander. Chuck was in the rest of the crew just showed up. Oh, no, they made it. Just arrived, Shepard. No casualties. Excellent. Yes! Now let's make it count. Okay. And what's our next step? There should be some nearby platforms that will take you to the main control console. From okay. There, you can overload the system and destroy the base. Okay. Commander, you got a problem. Hostiles massive just outside the door. Oh, <gasps> through. Oh, God. Um, someone has to hold this door. We better hurry. Oh no, what should I do? What should I do? Someone has to hold the door. We better hurry. Um, I'm guessing someone has to hold the door, right? All right. Um, oh God. I'm tempted to just say we better hurry because I don't want anyone else to hold the door and, and die. <laughs> you know? Oh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Someone has to hold this door. A rear guard could defend this position and keep the Collectors from overwhelming us. Pick a team to go with you, Shepard. Everyone else can bunker down here and cover your back. Okay. So, I'm picking a team to go with me. Everyone else is defending, so I I want my biggest hitters to defend, right? Like Grunt, Zai, probably. So who's gonna come with me? Um, because I'm thinking I want my my strongest people to be defending, right? So I'm like, do I take like Legion and maybe like Tali or, I mean, Miranda has been a pretty good leader so far. Maybe I should take her with me and then like Tali or something. Yeah, I'm gonna leave all my heavy hitters behind, I think. I think one last time for good measure, I think I'm gonna go with Girl Squad. We're doing pretty okay. Nobody's died yet. I'm gonna need like chocolate and a nap after this. All right, for this last bit, I wanna leave my heavy hitters behind. So I think I wanna do Miranda and Kasumi. All right, one more time. Girl squad, let's do it. All right, let's hope my instincts have been correct. Let's get it. Boop. Let's go, I'm girls. Ready, me too. Yes. Anything to say before we do this? Yes. Feel sorry for the collectors. Oh my god. Okay. Should I go renegade for the last one? Oh, my, my shades. I don't have my shades. All right. It's the last mission. I'm feeling spicy. Let's do a renegade one last time. Just for the end of the game. We've got all the paragon points we need. Let's do a renegade. Feel sorry for the collectors. The collectors blindside their targets. Hit and run. As powerful as they are, they're cowards. They've never had to stand and fight the best of us. That's you. 
Yes! Ooh, this is the last step. It's been a long journey, and no one's coming out without scars. Oh, but it Grunt! Comes down to this moment, we win or lose it all in the next few minutes. Make me proud. Make yourselves proud. Yes! Well, let's go finish this. Let's go, baby! Woo! Yes! <laughs> Renegade points! Woo! Enemies incoming! Where? Here they come. That's a rude as hell, dude. Get out of here! Hold the line! Let's go, girls. Nah, 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 nah. Dun, dun, dun. It's the menu music. Yes. Let's go. Ooh, this place is huge. What's up, baby? Oh, no, thank you. Nope. Don't want it. Stop your face. Oh, I wanted to charge him. Rude. Don't touch them. Rude as hell, dude. Enemies in Okay. Hi. Good. You ain't assuming control of nothing, dude. Get out of here. Oh no! Get down, Shep. Unity. Get up, Kasumi. You got this, babe. Let's go. That was rude as hell, dude. Get out of here. Get out of here, fool. Whoa! I will direct this personally. Good. Uh-oh, I gotta switch weapons. Can I get some ammo? Let's do it. Wee! Ammo, baby. Nope. No, thank you. Don't want it. No. No. <laughs> no, thank you. No. Fenris. Fenris is mewing right now. He's like, go, mommy. It's okay, Fenris. It's gonna be okay. Oh, snap. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come on, Shep. Giant zit. Giant zit. I'm gonna pop the giant zit. On. Yas. Dude, these guys are huge. Oh! Woo. Oh my god. Woo. All right, let's check for some ammo. Please get up, Shepard. All right, I got some ammo. Any more? Okay. Let's go. Boop. This is it. All the tubes lead to this spot. Oh Maybe god, okay, us. okay. What are they doing? The tubes are feeding into some kind of superstructure. It is emitting both organic and non-organic energy signatures. No. Nope. Given these readings, it must be massive. No thank you, nope. If my calculations are correct, the superstructure is a reaper. Oh god. Not just Human Reaper. Precisely. Oh. My. God. Oh. 
my god, what the hell? Dude, that's disgusting. Okay, you know, wow. Let's investigate. Why would they do this? What collectors gain by turning humans into this Ugh. shell? They may be facilitating the Reaper equivalent of reproduction. Or it may serve another purpose. I do not have the data Ugh. to speculate further. However, it is nope. clear that the collectors are merely pawns. The technology and ability needed to create this Reaper is not their own. It is likely that different species construct each Reaper. In this case, the collectors provide the labor. But they're Protheans. The collectors are just Protheans. Why would they help the Reapers? The Reapers subdued the Protheans long ago. Probability suggests they attempted to create a Prothean Reaper and failed. That's Over huge. Time, they Protheans to suit their needs, changed them, turned them into workers, tools for the Reapers. Holy crap. Why does it look human? It like a human. Why? It That's terrifying. That shape is based upon the species used to create it. Why use organics? Reapers are machines. Why do they need humans at wow. all? Wow. Correct. Reapers are sapient constructs, a hybrid of organic and inorganic material. The exact construction methods are unclear, but it seems probable Whoa. that the reapers huh. absorb the essence of a species, utilizing it in their reproduction process. Okay, um, significantly more? How many more humans do you think they'd try to take? Oh Millions. my god! Perhaps more. Impossible to know for certain. This is horrific. This Reaper appears to be in a very early stage of development. An embryo in human terms. Is it alive? So it's not alive yet. We can still stop it from being created? The process can be stopped, but it is unclear exactly how much it has developed. I cannot, for example, tell you if it has awareness. Okay, um, I think I've investigated all I can investigate, so, I mean, yeah, we can't let it survive. This thing is an abomination. We can't. Edie, how do we destroy it? The large tubes injecting the fluid are a weak structural link. Destroy okay. Destroy the force to collapse, and the Reaper to fall. Okay. Give us a minute, Edie. We gotta take care of some old friends first. Enemies incoming! All right. Hell, dude. Go on, Kasumi. Come on out, dude. Wait. Rude as hell. Rude as hell. Rude as hell. All right, we got two. We got two. Holy crap. Rude as hell, rude as hell, you're rude as hell, you're rude as hell, rude as hell, I don't appreciate your sass. God, so many. Get out of here, you nasty. I don't appreciate it. Shoot the injection tube. Team, status report. Oh my god. We are holding, but they keep coming. Oh my team. god! <laughs> oh my god! Head to the Normandy. Joker, prep the engines. Overload this place and blow it sky high. Roger that, Commander. Okay. Uh, Commander, I've got an incoming signal from the elusive man. He's okay. Through. What? What does he want? Shepard, you've done the impossible. Oh my god. Did we do it? 
Oh my god. Um, I didn't do it alone. Part of a team. Yeah, it's not just me. So gave their lives for this mission. I know. Their sacrifice will not be forgotten. You did what you had to do, and you acquired the collector base. I'm looking at the schematics Edie uploaded. A timed radiation pulse would kill the remaining collectors. Okay. Leave the machinery and technology intact. This is our chance, Shepard. They were building a Reaper. That knowledge, that framework could save us. Dude, okay. There he is again, seeing something this horrific and being like, yeah, let's keep it. No elusive man. Can I can I hang up? <laughs> can I hang up this call? Dude, okay, absolutely not. No. Liquefied people. No. This is something horrible. We have to destroy the base. Don't nope. be short-sighted. Our best chance against the Reapers is to turn our own resources nope. against them. I'm not so sure. Thank Seeing you. Using anything from this base seems like a betrayal. If we ignore this opportunity, that would be Oh a my god, no. Nope. Directly with the collectors. Who knows what information is buried there? This base is a gift. We can't just destroy it. <laughs> okay, first of all, why does he want to keep this so bad? Um, how can I trust you for the next thing I know you'll be wanting to grow your own Reaper. My goal is to save humanity from the Reapers at any cost. I've never hidden that from you. I Imagine don't trust how you. Lives could be saved if we keep this base intact and use its knowledge to thwart the Reapers. Imagine the lives that will be lost if we don't. Um, no. I feel like this is the reasoning the elusive man uses for every terrible decision that he makes. Everything's an opportunity, right? He's an opportunist. Regardless of who it kills, he's an opportunist, right? And he has tons of money. He doesn't care if people live or die. He acts like he does, but he, he really doesn't. Can I just hang up this call and end it? I don't feel right about this at all. No matter what kind of technology we might nope. find, it's not worth it. Nope. Shepard, you died fighting for what you believed. I brought you back so you could keep fighting. Some would say what we did to you was going too far, but look what you've accomplished. Okay. I discard you because I knew your value. Don't be so quick to discard this facility. Think of the potential. Honey, that's not gonna work on me. It may work on one of your Cerberus cronies, but it's not gonna work on me. I'm sorry. Like, you're literally seeing something that liquefied all these humans, and you're gonna sit here and tell me that it's something that we should keep? Are you out of your mind? Are you actually out of your mind? Like, seriously? Dude, how far is this guy willing to go? Seriously, like, how far is he willing to go? It's it's too much. And I don't trust him. I don't know what he's going to do with this technology. I don't trust him. Oh, yeah, sorry, I can't hear you. Oh, the message is, uh, signal's getting really bad. Sorry, I can't hear you. Huh? No, we don't need it. We'll fight and win without it. I won't nope. let fear compromise who I am. Miranda, do not let Shepard destroy the base. Or what? You'll replace me next? Oh, Miranda! I noticed. Consider this my resignation. Oh Shepherd, my God, Miranda! About everything Cerberus has done for you, you. Click. Oh, Miranda! Yes, go, Miranda. You tell him. Wow, I'm so proud of Miranda right now. <laughs> got ten minutes before the reactor overloads and blows this whole station apart. Oh my God. Okay, do we need to get out of here? Holy crap. How do we get out of here? Oh my god! Are we supposed to kill this thing? Where's my heavy weapon? Come here. Unity, unity. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Holy crap! This thing's huge!
We got this, we got this, we got this. Where is it? Giant baby! Oh, crap! Alright, back to regular weapons. <laughs> Okay, we're, we're almost there, we're almost there. All right, big baby, come on out. Come on, giant baby. All I wanna do is see you turn into a giant baby. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Kasumi! Oh! Oh my god, wait! Did I just skip a cutscene? I didn't press anything! Do you copy? Oh, that's weird! Come on, Shepard, don't leave me hanging! Do you copy? It just blipped to the Here, screen. Shepherd. Did the ground team make it? All survivors on board, we're just waiting oh! for you. Human. Oh my god! Nothing. Your species has bye bye. infinitely your greater. That which you know as Reapers might to destruction. Run, Shepard, run! Ooh, ooh. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh, Joker, get it, dude! Yes! Oh my god, are you kidding me? Come on, Shepard! Woo! Let's go, dude! Help her up, somebody, thank you! <laughs> Did we do it? I'm like holding my breath. I'm holding my breath. I'm holding my breath. I'm holding my breath. Shepard, you're making a habit of costing me more than time and money. Oops, sorry. Spare me the lecture, dude. I'm going renegade right now. The technology from that base could have secured human dominance in the galaxy against well, the tough. And beyond. Too bad. Human dominance or just Cerberus? Thank you. Strength for Cerberus is strength for every human. Is it though? Cerberus is humanity. I should have known you'd choke on the hard decisions. Too idealistic <gasps> from the start. You're on my team now, baby. That's right. 
he won't be alone. Humanity needs a leader who's looking out for them. From now on, I'm doing things my way, whether you agree or not. That's right, baby. Don't turn your back on me, Shepard. I made bye you. Bye. I you back from the dead. Should I? Should I do it? Should I? I'm in a great mood right now. Shut up. Joker, lose this channel. Oh, ho, ho, ho. peace out, Tim. Oh, the smirk, though. The smirk. Woo. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Oh, he's all by himself. So sad. <sighs> okay, I need to know. I need to know. Is everyone okay? I need to know. <sighs> I'm like holding my breath. <laughs> Oh, I think I see Kelly. Thane! Oh! Ja oh! <laughs> Jack Legion! Grunt! Garrus! Oh my god! Jack! Grunt! Garrus! Joker! Oh snap! What is that? Did we save everyone? <gasps> what? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy! <laughs> How did I not lose anyone? Oh my god, I can relax now! God, I can't believe it! I can't believe it! Nobody died! Oh my god! I was so scared of losing somebody. I didn't know who it was gonna be, but I was like, every decision I make is important. I'm so nervous. Garrus basically said, it's a suicide mission. We're gonna lose someone. So I was like, someone's going to die probably, right? Oh god. The part where I was most determined was when I had to activate the things to save Tali. I was like, get the hell out of my way. Like, <laughs> get out of my way. <laughs> I am genuinely shook right now. Like at the end, I was like, somebody had to have died. <laughs> somebody had to have died. Is everyone okay? I mean, the only one who died was the giant baby. <laughs> I was worried when the door opened and Joko was standing there with a gun. I was like, get your little butt back in the ship right now what do you think you're doing he did way too much walking this episode oh the credits are over oh we're we going back to the normandy let's see let's see what's gonna happen Ooh, you have stopped the collectors from creating a human reaper you now have two choices one continue this game complete unfinished missions develop relationships play downloaded content and explore the galaxy for anything you missed or two, import Shepard, start a new game with this character at your current level with your current weapons, as well as bonus starting credits and resources. Let's hit continue. Oh, I'm back in my room. Boop. The fishies. Hi, guys. <gasps> Kelly, 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 <laughs> Kelly, <laughs> Kelly, Kelly. Commander, you received a new message at your private terminal. Hello, Kelly. Hello, Kelly. Oh my God, Kelly, I'm so glad you're okay. Kelly, I was so worried. Kelly, I thought you were dead. Not cool, Kelly. Don't ever do that to me again. Don't ever do that to me again, Kelly. <laughs> Kelly, Kelly, Kelly. Oh my God. I knew you would. Thank you. Yay. Thank you. Are you okay, I'm Kelly? I'm holding up. Just can't get the memories out of my head. Trapped. Suffocating. It's oozing oh. into every pore. Faint sobs echoing the confined space. But she I, sounds I like well. Thane. I'm okay now. I'm alive. Back to the old Kelly. Oh my god, she sounded like Thane. 
that was weird. That was really weird. I'm weirded out. How is the crew? Is anything I should know? Everyone's traumatized. Anything else, Commander? Kelly. Oh my god. Kelly, I'm so glad you're okay. I was so worried, Kelly. I thought you were dead. I saw them drag you into the elevator and I thought they killed you. Oh my god, Kelly. They just came and snatched them all off the ship. That was awful. All right, see you, Kelly. Yay, Kelly's okay. You know who I need to go talk to also? Is Joker. Yeah. Yeah. Woohoo. Hi, Joker. Dude, Joker did amazing. The crap is over. It is over, right? Oh, God, I hope so. It's never over. <laughs> it's never over. I like how they've all been through this traumatic experience and they're already back at work. Like, what? The good old days. Think about the old Normandy and the trouble. Oh, my God. Yeah, those seem like the good old days now, but come on. <sighs> hell at the time. Death, I can breathe now. Sovereign? I can breathe now. We got dumped. We're stuck in a weird place, sure, but back then it wasn't all sunshine and bunnies. All right, dude. Um, how are things in the cockpit? Things going well up here. You know, this is really nice. Edie took up the slack in every department. I could get used to this kind of help. It is not. Oh. All of your responsibilities, Jeff. No, no, no. I'm good. Just keep me updated. Quietly. <laughs> Joker, don't abuse it. I want your eyes on everything. Eyes are easy, Commander. I got eyes covered. I believe covering your eyes would be counter to Shepard's intention. Human intentions are tough But keep trying, you'll get the hang of it. Joker. All right, all right. <laughs> He's being such a little shit. All right, see you guys. See you, Commander. Morden, Morden, Morden. Morden, Morden. Yay, Morden! Collectors destroyed. Yay! Extremely impressive. Elusive man will be displeased. Fortunately, Tough. not human myself. Not my problem. <laughs> not human myself. Not my problem. Thank you, my I'll dear. You. We'll be here if you need me. Thank you so much. Next. All right, Jacob. Do you have anything new? I expect you to light up that base, Shepard. Hell of a way to tell the boss you're quitting. I wish I could have seen his face. It's not over. We did it. We did it. That guy's on the horizon. And now Cerberus wants your tail. Never boring, huh? I don't know what nope. kind of time we have, but we better dust off and stay ready. You sure as hell know how to make enemies. Cool. Um, we'll talk. All right, later. dude. Come See in. ya. Thank you. All right, let's go. Commander, you received oh. a new message at your private terminal. I have a message. What is it? Oh my God. <gasps> Kelly! Kelly told me I had messages and it's a message she sent me. From Kelly Girls, she has a screen name. Hi honey, I keep thinking back to our evening together and I'd love to spend more time with you. How about I slip into something more comfortable and sneak up to your cabin tonight? I plan on wearing something I can't talk about during work hours. You'll just have to call me up there to see it. Love, Kelly. <gasps> I guess she's really uh, grateful that I saved her life. <laughs> Kelly, you don't have to do this. I mean, Kelly. I don't know if you remember, but I'm taken by the shadow broker, Liara. Do you know who my girlfriend is? Thank you for the offer, Kelly. Oop. <laughs> Dr. Chocolates. Are you okay? I'm so glad we saved her, boop. A little shaken from my abduction by the collectors. Oh, it was a lot to endure. You and Jeff came so quickly. I've never had truer friends. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, Doctor Chocolates. I'm so glad we were able to save you. Oh, hello. Excuse me, sir. Don't mean to bother you. <laughs> you're resting. Legion. Hello, Boop. An interesting choice, Shepard Commander. Your Thank you. Was offered everything Geth aspired to. True unity, understanding, transcendence. You rejected it. You even refused the possibility of using the old machine's gifts to achieve it on your species' own terms. You are more like us than we thought. Thank you, Legion. 
See ya. I have to get back to work. Acknowledged. Thanks for your help, Legion. I appreciate it. Boop. Love you, Dr. Chocolates. You're amazing, sweetie. Boop. Garrus! I can't believe you took down the collectors. I'm proud to serve under you, Commander. Hawthorne is still- Thank in you. Memory, though I think his pride is more broken than his bones. Oh. That's the guy that usually sits here. I think that was the guy who was like, Joker, I'll cover you while you run through. Good job for that guy, dude. He was awesome. Garrus! Garrus! Oh, Garrus, you did so well. For Sarah, now the collectors. Remind me never to get on your bad side, Shepard. I don't Yay! Know. You did great, Garrus. I'm so proud of you. Wee! I'm so happy! I'm so happy everyone's okay. Like, I'm so relieved. I can't even explain. Miranda, good job, sweetie. Shepherd. Taking down the collector base was the right decision. I was so proud of her. But we had no choice. Nice. Good oh, job, Miranda. Of course, Commander. So proud of her. She stood up to him and was like, bye. <laughs> it was awesome. Thane, 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 Thane. Hi, Thane. You had to make a difficult choice, Shepard. For what it's worth, I believe you made the correct one. Thank you. I shall return to my meditations. It's just so, uh, it's so lovely to see everyone in their quarters and they're okay. They're chilling. Kasumi. Hey, Shepard. Hi. I'm glad to hear Thane and his son are back in touch. Kasumi has hot. nothing to say. <laughs> Thanks, Kasumi. You were amazing today, sweetie. Thank you for your help. Samara, dude, MVP of the mission today. I wanted to tell you, I believe you did the right thing by destroying that base. Samara was amazing. He thinks he has the wisdom to utilize it, but he does not. Mm-hmm. I agree. Thanks, Samara. Of course. Oh, Mess Sergeant Gardner. Hello. You really are a hero. No sooner had the Collectors damned us than you were pulling our sorry asses right back out of hand. Your ace is in my book, Shepard. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm glad I was able to save everyone. My baby son, I'm so proud of you. Shepard, and when you blew up the base instead of handing it to Cerberus. Ha! <laughs> Something to think about. If you killed the most dangerous thing in the galaxy, that leaves us. I love the way he thinks. I love you, sweetheart. Shepherd. You did so well. Mommy's so proud of you. <laughs> Boop. Boop. This mission takes me back. Alright, dude. <laughs> Thanks for the chat. Jack! Jack was awesome. Boop. Hey. Oh, I guess she doesn't have much to say, huh? Shepard, we talked enough. You're just pissing around. No <laughs> hard feelings, but I don't want to play. <sighs> okay, no worries. I should go. Whatever. Love you. All right, bye. <laughs> Hello, Engineer Donnelly. Boop. Thanks for coming to get us, Commander. I've oh, you're so welcome. Me. You arrived just in time. Thank you. You're welcome. Will do, Commander. Keep working. <laughs> Dolly! Oh! I can't believe we destroyed the Collector Base. Yay! Be done. Then again, that said about a lot of things you do. Oh, thank you, Tolly. Bye. You work. Talk to you later. Thank you, sweetie. I appreciate it. Yay! No for you, Commander. I know, Kelly. I saw the message that you left for me. Kelly. Slightly inappropriate, Kelly, but I'll allow it. You've been through a lot, Kelly. I'm proud of you. Thank you for everything. All right, my darlings, that is officially the end of Mass Effect 2. I am, quite frankly, shooketh. We do still have a rival to do, and I'm going to do it as kind of an epilogue. So while we are done with Mass Effect 2, next time we'll be doing the arrival mission as sort of a prequel to Mass Effect 3. People told me to save it for last until after the final mission, so I'm going to be doing it next. Once we've done arrival, we will be moving on to Mass Effect 3. I cannot believe it. 
everything that happened in this mission, I was certain at the end that somebody had died, that something had happened, and I was so worried about losing somebody from the crew. When the collectors first came and took everybody, I thought that Kelly was dead, Dr. Chocolates was dead, like I thought everybody was dead. So it was even sweeter that we got to rescue them and bring them back to the Normandy. And we told the elusive man to stuff it, which was a perfect ending to the game. I can't believe how well this turned out. I was so emotional the whole time. I was holding my breath. What a ride. This was incredible. I loved that we got to play as Joker at one point. It was wild seeing the collectors on the Normandy dragging people away. That was tough to watch. Thank you all for joining me for the story of Mass Effect 2. I can't wait for Arrival. And Mass Effect 3 is just around the corner. Get ready. Thank you so much for joining me for Mass Effect 2. If you're enjoying this playthrough and want to see more, go ahead and let me know by hitting the thumbs up and leaving me a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications button on your way out so you can be notified when new videos go up. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.